Cole School Approach Hello. So, you would like to know more about whole school approaches? What it is and how it is practiced? Then, you are watching the right video. Let's start with some theoretical basics. Yes. According to UNESCO, the whole school approach aims to mainstream sustainability into all aspects of the educational institution and involves rethinking the curriculum, campus operations, organizational culture, student participation, leadership and management, community relationships, and research. Also, there is a model which can describe fields for developments in schools. Of course. Scientists developed a model to show fields for sustainable developments in schools, it is simply called the 4 C's model. Accordingly, the fields of sustainable development in schools can be the campus, the curriculum, and the community of the school. Making changes in these fields changes the culture of the school. But also changing the school culture can affect the campus, the curriculum, and the school community. Do you like the model? Is it helpful and does it make you already see processes that create effects in your school? Can we have a closer look into the model? Of course. The sustainable development field campus refers to the insight that how buildings and resources are managed and operated affects learning about sustainability. One leading question in the development field campus is, how can a school better use its campus to increase the quality and effectiveness of sustainability education? Schools that want to start to make developments in this field mostly start with greening the campus, for example, with new plants inside and trees outside the school. Furthermore, one school in Austria put some effort into providing healthy food to its students with only one meat day a week, the rest of the week they eat regional vegetarian and vegan food. Okay. And many further ideas are currently being discussed and have been brought into practice to foster sustainable development opportunities on school campuses. Yes. Here is one more idea. What about making your school campus a good living campus, where you as a teacher and your students feel comfortable in the daily school life and in working on sustainable developments? Therefore, you can establish a pedagogical garden for instance, which you can use for your teachings and for your resting time as well. This garden you can create together with your students. Do you have further ideas? Ideas for a more sustainable school campus have better chances to be successful when further points are considered. You can see your school as a testing field for sustainable change. Stimulate innovative potential by giving students, parents, teachers, staff and other stakeholders a place where they are heard and taking part of the developing process. Participate all members of your campus, from the youngest to the oldest. Think also about the idea of getting some support from parents or external experts. Start with an, even small, team including students but involve more members of your campus and beyond with the time. Communicate openly about your ideas and intentions. Also, have some place for critical reflections with others. The 4Cs model also refers to the question of how schools can integrate sustainable developments in their curriculum. Yes. To work in this field, you need to get involved in the school's decision-making processes by gaining the support of open-minded people in your school and using change opportunities. For example, you can suggest integrating or add sustainability topics in lessons and school projects. This can be accompanied by an annual sustainability topic schools choose. Lectures and school projects can pick up this topic. This topic can be about sustainable energy systems, waste, the wood, or something else. You can be very creative by choosing your annual topic, See that it relates to the interests of your students and has actual relevance. A further idea is to establish a sustainability declaration in your school. Or have you already thought about a future workshop or a future council, as it is part of a school in Germany? In some schools in Austria and Germany, highly functioning democratic decision-making structures, in form of a junior parliament or regular council meetings between the student, representative, 
and the head of the school are established. It turned out that the participation of students in decision-making processes can create the needed creativity and momentum for sustainable change. In some cases, changes in the curriculum can lead to changes in the school's identity or its profile. So be ready to be open to embrace change. Oh, that sounds exciting. Indeed. Changes in sustainable education can be very exciting. Let's continue. The Sustainable Development Field community refers to the insight that schools are embedded in a wider community, beyond the physical borders of your school, your school is influencing and influenced by the world. Therefore, it is important to engage students with the real world, this is because students are not merely consumers of education, but co-creators of knowledge and gatekeepers to the community, for example their parents and friends. They are drivers of change. School projects with ecological, social, and economic sustainability dimensions can empower students and the school to become a whole school. So here are some ideas to create developments in the field community of the 4 C's model. What about organizing a river cleaning project in the school's environment, as it is done by a school in Portugal? Or have you ever thought about organizing a fundraising event for people in need by auctioning students' created paintings as it was done by an Austrian school? And one last idea, have you ever thought about your school as a meeting place, where the future of schooling and topics of sustainability are discussed with the wider school community? I want to highlight that by creating sustainable changes in the fields of campus, curriculum and community in your school, you are part of a heartful and meaningful movement all around the world, which currently changes how we live on this planet and how we see and do schooling. We are changing our culture in a sustainable way. Please tell me more about that. So, let's have a closer look to the fourth sustainable developing field culture. The sustainable development field culture refers to the values, norms, and mindset within schools. These can be developed by creating awareness of environmental issues and social responsibilities. For example, with training courses for teachers and the school staff. A primary school in Norway perceives the focus on collaboration and diversity as a resource for transformative learning and school development. Together with sustainable leadership and school resources values, norms, and mindset can undergo transformations to create an ESD effective school. So, what do you think about the 4 C's model? Does it help you to see possibilities of change in your school? Would you change something in the 4 C's model? Let us know in the comments.